How does it feel to finally be able to say that you're engaged? It feels so good, and I'm so excited to share the news, and I'm excited for two months when I can finally reveal who it is. How hard is it to keep all of these secrets? It's difficult, um, but it's kind of nice right now, honestly, because I just got home last week from filming, and so it's kind of nice to still live in the bubble and have some secrets between us at this point. I'm so excited to watch the show back, and... I mean, I lived it, but there's also so much that I missed when I wasn't around the guys. And so I am just, I'm ready to watch it back, but I'm also ready and excited for everyone to meet these 28 great guys. I came onto this journey knowing that I was going to have to talk about my time last year and my relationship with Ari, and I knew that the guys would have questions about it. And so it's something that we talked about throughout the entire journey. Um, because it's part of my story and it's led me to why I'm where I'm sitting um, and it's just it's just who I am and, and it's in the past now but right now I'm just so focused on the present and you know watching it all play back and and my relationship at this point that that's all I'm really focused on what pressure did you feel on that night one as you're looking at so many guys to pick your first impression of? Um, it was interesting because there were so many guys that stuck out that night that I laughed with, that made me smile, that made me feel hopeful again. And so I was like, you know, so many of these guys would be a great contender for this first impression, Rose. Um, yeah, it was just somebody who made me laugh. And, you know, but that's not to say the other guys weren't great because every one of them did something wonderful out of the limo and wonderful throughout every conversation that I had that night and beyond. It was just who that night stood out and you know everything I mean living through last season I realized how quickly things can change. Anything can change in a moment and so I just did it in that moment. Mm -hmm. I was not <laughs> expecting drama on night one which we got a taste of and yeah, I mean, that's scattered throughout the entire season. There were a lot of laughs, a lot of tears, some fights between the guys, and so that'll all play out. Um, I mean, and, and I think viewers will have something to look forward to each week. Starting out, it's difficult to see any red flags because I'm still getting to know all of these guys, and they're just getting comfortable, really, with each other and in the mansion. And so I went into it knowing what I wanted in a partner, and really focusing on those qualities. Like I wanted honesty, I wanted somebody who was carefree, who could make me laugh, who was open and not judgmental. Um, and so at first it's, I was just focused on that as opposed to the red flags because those didn't really come out till a little bit later. The do the damn thing. Honestly, I think I need to uh, retire that tagline. It came out of my mouth last year, and I wasn't even expecting to say that. It just kind of popped out, and I was like, did, that, did I really just say that? Um, yeah, you know, I'm ready to put it to bed, though. <laughs> I need a new tagline, I guess.